Welcome back. Here we are in Ornit, Amodea. So we need to take out this antechamber here so we can head on to the next Ornit. I don't know what you want to call them. The second antechamber. We finally found it. I know. I could have got here much more stylish, but I, I didn't. I can't tell you how happy I am you're here. I'm really glad Neldo and Newton found you. Oh, I never told you about my power to move time. I've had this power ever since I was a little girl. You don't say. I may have noticed this. But I never knew how to trigger it at will. So whenever I used it, I never knew how far back I would go. At first, this power didn't seem like something that could bring hope. But everything changed after Great Sage Newton made his prophecy. The key to victory has been discovered. A name. Hundred Knight. We didn't know what the name meant. Was it a person? A place? A thing? No one had any idea. As the battle intensified, some gave up. Others ran away. And some killed themselves rather than live with the horror. Uh, oh! Sounds pleasant. Our witch brigade was composed of the strongest witches from all over the world. But now, they're all gone. Neldo and Newton never gave up, though. They allowed their souls to be sent to the past so they could obtain the source of the name mentioned in the prophecy. Not long after, I used my ability to sense wandering souls and discovered that your name is the true name of the Tractatus de Monstrum. Well, that's convenient. Though that book no longer exists in this world, learning its true name allowed me to make an important discovery. The Keystone Antechambers. They're the crux of everything. We discovered one of these antechambers during our second attack on Velcarana. It appeared to be an ordinary room, but for some reason Velcarana had stationed an avatar there. In hindsight, I think she was testing whether we knew the secret of the antechamber, and if we were capable of activating it. I used every means at my disposal to research it, but I couldn't find any new leads. And every time we discovered an antechamber, it would shift deeper into the labyrinth. But when I learned that you were the true name of the Tractatus de Monstrum, that's when everything finally made sense. This antechamber was created by Baba Yaga, and it has transformed along with her. Now it's her weak point. She created the Tractatus de Monstrum to connect the antechambers. By being in this room, you can connect them too. Ooh. You're the key to activating the antechambers and creating the disruption within Velkavrana that will destroy the ward. Now, Tracti, let's activate it. With this soul that has witnessed the worlds beyond, I bind this twisted dimension. Wait, we're not having a fight? All right. Great job. Let's keep moving. I thought, I, I thought we were going to have a fight. No? Oh. All right, then. Let's go to the next dungeon. Seems quite odd. Alright then, so on it, first floor. Camp... 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 Campanuala. That, that'll do, is the name. Okay, so it's just strange... Okay, so we're heading straight up there. So looking at the map... We need to get over to the top right hand corner there are switches all over the places but it looks like we can destroy walls to just get past things so it's sort of like we don't really need to do much here maybe there's a boss after this though so maybe that's where the difficulty of this dungeon comes in okay so looking at where we are now okay so we can go through here we go through there and then through this wall, we get an enemy. You know, I will as I expected. You. I expected this to happen. I always knew there'd be an enemy here. Oh, this is fantastic. We got an enemy that's actually mana. Yeah, just pure mana. There, exactly there. what we need. Because I'm really low on mana at the moment. Could do with Understood. quite a bit of mana. Here we go. Good. Know, you got away. it? At least we got you dead. The mana oh, prison. Yeah. Uh, how do we do in terms of mana for that fight? Nice. 4k, near enough, near enough. Right, okay, so where are we here? If we proceed upwards... 
Uh, we can go through here, maybe through this door here. Nope, right, okay, so we'll just... Boom. Right, and... I didn't know this was going to be here. This has thrown me off. So it's like, this is where I was actually going to blast through the wall and actually get to where I wanted to be. So this does change things. I, I can't go through the hole? I will annihilate you! Do this it like doesn't... This. Well, no, now the dungeon's got a bit more complex. I like when it just surprised me. But it does look like we can go further up here and actually get to a switch anyway. Just wondering when you're going to turn around. Yeah. Okay, so looking at where we are here. Okay, so we go through now. Lovely, lovely. Is this the right way? No, next door. There we go. I hear a door unlock, but... Ooh. Why has that got a symbol on the door? The question is, which door has unlocked? I just don't know. There seems to be several locations I can choose from in here as to where to go. Huh. I think we'll go out here. Up here. Through that door. I was just wondering whether or not that one was locked as well. That would have been like, oh no. I'll blast through here. Still not 100% where to go in here. See, these places are just... I expect them to be open to me. They're just not. Oh, of course there's an enemy what behind the door. Go? Wait, if that... If I can't actually blast through the... Like, like go through those caves, maybe I can destroy them. And go through. How disappointing. If they're not actually cave caves... Maybe, maybe I'm doing this all wrong and I can actually destroy them. And get through this hole if I can. Okay, so from here there's chest there, but we're being chased by an enemy. If the enemy stays on that side, we may as well get that dirge. Dirge. No. Yum, 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 yum. Lots of mana enemies around here from the looks of it. This might actually be good to actually level up around this location. I say level up, it's not actually leveling up at this point. It's just getting more equipment. That's what I really need. Okay, your gun. It is a total victory, yes. Some lovely mana coming our way as well. Right, okay, so. I want to head back to the opposite side and see if my theory is correct. Right, so. Yes! Right, so it was trying to trick me. Oh. That's the issue here. Right, so there's a lot of poisons going on here. There's not really anything I can do to avoid it. Which means Let's I'm going to get, get the started. cloudy things. Let's make sure these things die, because I don't know what they're going to be able to do. Fire was probably best to choose for both of them, but... Oh, well. Here we go. Oh, no. Doesn't really matter. They are weak, like the rest. You! You! It did! Okay. Now, of course, that's the only problem. You can't see the enemies. Just do normal attacks, although one of them has got... Buffed, so it might be an idea to actually use some of my big magic to take this thing out. Yeah. I think that was the one that was buffed, so we should be alright now. Alright, right, yes, poison, yes. Okay, destroy. Got you. Still need to get my dust packs as well. They should be around somewhere. You can There's me so now. much poison coming up on this map, it's gotta be annoying. Okay, so we need to go in here. Maybe there's a switch, but it's like. Who needs a switch? Silver spoon, lovely. Okay, let's go in here. We're gonna get attacked as a result. Oh no. Oh. It was on the I other side of the wall. Alright! Chabus! There's quite a few of them. Um, attack. Make sure there's one near the front, though. Jeez. Just the amount of them is just hilarious. Oh, we're gonna have to wait 20 minutes now while they do attacks. Alright, come on now. Come on. Yep. Yeah. You can see how the tanking is working here. It's like they're all going for the ones that are in the tank position, which is very, very nice. That's the entire purpose of this setup. Oh my god! I better get loads of XP for this or mana. Oh, here we go. Witness, I will obey. Is that yet? 
Yep. 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 Yeah. Yeah, we we got him. We got him. Oh dear. That lasted a while, didn't it? We didn't really get much mana at all. We may as well get this chest while we're here. Oh, god damn it. I was going to say, oh, please not again. Please not the same thing again. Where's those guys? It would have been quite annoying, wouldn't it? Gotta be careful of my reinforcements as well. We should be alright, because it looks like there's just doors coming up. Whether or not we needed switches to activate these doors, I don't think so. We could be wrong. We can go around them, but it's just got to be wary of my reinforcements so I don't screw myself over, basically. Overside Black Rose. Oh. Yum, 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 yum. So, that's the only thing I dislike about this fog effect. It's just, I know it just makes it hard to see the enemies, but it's like, I, it just gets annoying. It's like, I want to just see the enemies. Ta. Yep, 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 yep. I won! You did. Okay. Oh my god. Oh no! Let's get this out. Just, just, just uh, I don't know. Come on. Alright, here we go. So, uh, right, I'm gonna go make myself a cup of tea. Alright? So I'll see you in a minute. Not really, because it's, it's not that long. It would take about three minutes for it to properly brew. But a few minutes before that to actually make the kettle boil, you know. Definitely getting a cup of tea in between the parts, though. Of course. It would be foolish not to. Hopefully there's not many enemies down this long corridor that we have to go through. It's quite annoying. I think I've got an idea of what I want to do instead, though. We will use our reinforcements to get through this much easier. Oh. It might actually be worth staying in here and actually attacking some of these things. Actually, even though we're on the poison, which is a bit annoying. Because we can do get quite, quite a few things from this. Bit of XP. But we get these things, which is very, very nice. Because, like the nether coat, I know that's good for defense. Because I do have one of those. On you, we see here. There's never coach. I mean, it's a blue one, but you can see the defense is quite high, which is very nice to have. And combine it with other things, it could be worth having Step around, couldn't it? Right, and let's go. I should really be using fire on the ones when there's loads of them, shouldn't I? Here we go. This is very effective against them. Very, very effective. You can praise me now. I, I, no. I won't. Alright, what do we get? Flower shoe. Alright, so. Another enemy. Oh dear. Oh dear. Alright then, flame dance. Attack. And a flame dance. Do it. Over there. Yep. <laughs> yep. Gotcha. At least we'll get loads of items from this. That's something. This would be a good place to level up, like I said. It might be worth doing. Still can't do the big leveling up that I was going to do. Because of the cold, it's still so tired. The thing is, the main part of the cold for me, where it's like the runny nose, etc., that disappears very quickly. Then it just goes to my chest. Then it's too much for me. Still hard to breathe properly. Sneezing is horrible at the moment, let's put it like that, it's terrible. We actually got one, didn't we? No? No. You've got to attack every single one. Actually got one deaded before the big attacks. Two deaded. Three deaded. Four deaded. Five deaded. Don't empower. The rest deaded. Right, let's see what equipment we get from this, because these are actually really good for go. equipment farming. How disappointing. Indeed. See? Yes, yeah, see, these, these are good. Like, the sealed stuff should be good. And we're getting the mana with it as well. 
Just waiting there for the enemy on the other side to disappear. Right, in front of us should be what we need from here. Um, there's a chest in here, so I may as well get it. Would proof fail. It's not great, in my opinion. We're going to have to face the thing behind us. It's clearly there, look. Oh. It wasn't. Okay. Fine. Made me look a fool. Made myself look a fool. It's probably on the other side of this wall. Right, so let's go out. And I'll make a save. And we'll come back. And we'll face off against the boss. Maybe? <laughs> and I said that last time, didn't I? And it wasn't right at all. So, we'll see you in just a second. Right then, let's proceed. An enormous, pulsating black mass appears in the sky above the shattered ceiling. Look, that dark residue is one of Velcarana's silent avatars. Damn, what's it doing here? Velcarana must know what we're up to. Don't be careless, Tracti. That thing's just as strong as the hatched Velcarana you defeated in the past. It single-handedly destroyed half of the world in its rampage. It's incredibly dangerous. Should be easy enough. But we can't just ignore it. Together we can defeat it. Maybe. Maybe. No, 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 that's what I say as a joke. You're not gonna... No! No, no. What are you doing, Mezaluka? Why are you acting so weak? Show that thing who's boss. That's better. The black mass slowly begins to descend. Don't worry. You'll be fine. Now let's do it. Eh. Stop resisting! Stop resisting. Hello? It's got things in its back. Don't like it. Right, White Rose Champion. We're just gonna see what we can do at this point. Will dampen. White Rose Champion. Iron Eye, definitely, definitely. And Phalanx Attack. Do it like this. Watch me. Wait, 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 what do you mean we can buy evil thoughts? What does that mean? What did you do? This is quite... Hmm. Trixie, Trixie, Trixie. So, Lamp Fog. Is Donum. Magic Mirror, maybe? I'm just gonna see. I'm just gonna see. We'll throw out a White Rose Bouquet. And a Piercing Rush. And we'll just attack with you. Stop weakening me with <laughs> evil thoughts. I like these evil thoughts. These voices in my head. They're telling me to do things. Here we go. Make a cup of tea. Oh wait, that's normal. That's just my normal voice. Uh, it's just completely normal. Don't worry about that. Okay, so... Right, mud fling maybe? Um... It would be okay to do another flame dance maybe. Better for you. Affected by illusion. Oh, we definitely need a heal actually going out here. Here I got this. So I think the mud seems to be the best option here. I missed, eh? <laughs> definitely need a heal out there with those guys. Okay, so mud seems to be the best option, I think. I think. Let's make sure we try and keep these guys up. We'll get the white rose bouquet though, and we'll get the um, defense up again, just in case. Yep, move your ass. Yeah, that's, see, that was the issue. Was like, I was hoping I'd get the heal out before that came our way. Here we go. Doom, doom, doom. Okay, so. Um, throw out the lamp fog again, just to see what happens. Okay, we'll go and use item, Jitterberg. Use item, Jitterberg, and use item, what could we throw at it? What could we throw at it? Hmm. Not sure. Old bread, maybe? Just throw that there. May as well. Okay, so a, a mud fling, and a pissing rush attack. Do it like take two. Oh, I didn't expect you guys to get hit as well there. Here I got this. Has it gone red? I don't know. I'm like not sure on its colour scheme whether or not it would actually look like it had gone red. Oh, I didn't expect you two to get killed by that. Yeah, oh, lamp fog. Okay, so yep. Again, we want the chitter bugs. Jetbook's very, very important. 
I want to use that really, but can't, obviously. Heal self. Why are we using heal self there? Like, I wanted to heal self, but when you put it on the white rose pact, but I can't, obviously. They are my main attack, so I kind of, kind of need to have them do things. Let's get that heal going, definitely. Alright, so use item. Jitterbug. Get yourselves back up. Use item now. Just fight. And you use lamp fog. Piercing rush. Attack. Come on. Get my heal going, please. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. It was healed, was it? All right. Get White Rose Champion again. Sharing is caring. And White Rose Champion. Missing rush. Tech. <laughs> Thanks for waiting. Don't um, guide me. Yeah, this one's for you. Just make sure we've got all this stuff going around. We can increase our damage, etc. Feels like we need it. Okay, so lamp fog. Will dampen. No, fuck. I ain't hide. Phalanx. Better <laughs> no, that's unfortunate. <laughs> no, she's got all that if defense from that new piece of equipment, but still not enough to keep her alive. Here we go. <laughs> right, we got it into the red. Lovely, lovely. All right, so we still want to go full on attack, really. Sharing on yourself. No, fuck. Yourself is. Pointless. And we'll get that going again. Oh, you, you ties. You guys took the brunt there just so we could get this out. It's lovely. Oh, I thought that would be it. Right, so we're going to go with Lamp Fog. Sharing. There. Another Lamp Fog. Attack, attack, attack. Come on, we're there. Come on. Feel it. Thanks for waiting. Lovely. Gotcha. Fantastic. I won. You did. I hear the darkness calling. Oh dear. Sealed relic. We we did it, Tracty. Yeah, That's all right. Of course. It all makes sense now. Oh yeah, of course. What? If a powerful avatar of Velcarana is guarding a room, then the room must be an answer chamber. But the last one didn't have one. We can do it, Tracty. Connecting the answer chambers will surely lead to Velcarana's heart. Damn. Why didn't I realize it sooner? Then again, I didn't really have time to notice. Not with everyone dying around me. Alright, bit gloomy. And even if I had, we still would have needed you to connect all the answer chambers in the first place. At the moment, a shadow rises from the floor and begins to materialize into a human form. Hmm? Is that you, Mesaluka? And you are? Z Zoro? You're alive, Mesaluka. I'm so relieved. Yeah, but I've been preoccupied with a few things. And Spina. She. Spina's gone, huh? Well, her head is. Don't know about the rest. I see. How unfortunate. I also come bearing bad news. I'm all but certain that number four has killed Fran and Naja. Fran and Naja? Yes? Yes. Oh. I also haven't been able to make contact with Harkin, Nazca, or Labeline. I can't imagine them being defeated so easily, but... Maybe it's Labeline. A peculiar scent is in the air as of late. It does not sit well with me. Furthermore, the interior structure of the labyrinth has changed since our last assault. Yeah. In actuality, after we activated the first antechamber, the stairs, stairways connecting each world have vanished. Is it changing every time? Why are you not speaking your inner thoughts? Normally you do. The Dronia puppets on the surface have begun to return to Velkuvrana. 
Our past assaults never provoked such a response. Why is this happening now? By the way, what happened to your Funa puppets? They're probably making their way to the heart on their own. Or maybe they're looking for the other antechambers like I am. Probably? Maybe? Sort of. Kinda. I don't actually know where they are. My connection to them was severed the moment they entered the labyrinth. On the surface, I encountered Bomb, another avatar of Elkavrana. I barely escaped his attempt to seal me in another dimension. Bomb is still alive? Indeed, he is a troubling adversary. Hmm? What's that pendant you're wearing? It's me! Hmm? This? <laughs> Nothing gets past you, Zoro. This is the Chosen One. Then, Operation Conquer was a success? Okay. Mezaluka explains everything to Zoro. Okay. I understand now. Well done, Mezaluka. It's simply a matter of connecting these keystone antechambers to each other. In that case, we should search for Nazca. With her clairvoyance, we'll easily find the other antechambers. Also, it might be wise to avoid the lower recesses of the labyrinth. It's crawling with Dronia puppets. Hmm? There must be an antechamber there. Let's go together, Zoro. No, you don't need my help. Not if you have your brigade. But, Zorok, we'll be safer if we stick together. You always thought Spina was the strongest of us. Perhaps you were underestimating my power as the Shadow Witch. Besides, I work best alone. No other witch is as skilled in assassination. Have you forgotten that I'm the only one who has killed the Dronia Poppet by herself? No, no, we have as well now. No, I haven't, but... I'm not ready to give up my search for the heart. I mean, do we count as a lone...? I'm, I'm not sure. As long as one of us finds it, we'll gain the upper hand. But, but if Newton's prophecy is correct, then... Just do what I say, Mesaluka. This assault is our last chance. For the sake of the Fallen, we cannot afford to fail right now. But thanks to their sacrifice, I think we're finally starting to see a glimmer of hope. Just a glimmer? Triple dot, alright. Now go! I have faith that your Operation Conquer will be a smashing success. And if anyone's going to avenge Neldo, it's going to be me. Avenge? Huh? Never mind. It's nothing. Now go! Uh-huh. Status of the eight great witches. Mesaluka and Zoro. Okay. Alive. Continuing their search, separate from one another. Spina, Fran, and Naja. Deceased. Ha Harkenrail, Nazca, and maybe it's Labeline. Status unknown. While Zoro, okay, searches for Velkuvrana's heart, Mesaluka resumes her search for the next antechamber. Right, so we'll head over to the next place. So we've got it opened up at least. Right, so it's going to be Umbra. Oh, all right then. Right, but we're going to be ending this part here, and in between the parts, I might go get some mana and stuff. You know, in between my naps. Just still try and recover from this damn cold. But anyway, we'll see you in the next part. Ta-ta for now.